All right, we're joined by Brett Moffitt, driver number 25, who qualified fourth just now, I believe. Uh, first off, Brett, tell us about that lap you laid down. Yeah, it was really good. Our AM Technical Solutions Ford Mustang was uh, good in race trim. We got to be a little bit better there, but um, yeah, that kind of pleasantly surprised me in qualifying to be able to lay down a lap like that. Um, you know, it's, it's always good to have track position from the get-go. Now we just got to work on keeping it all race long and uh, just really proud of everyone on this race team for, for bringing such a fast race car this week. And it, it's pretty much a brand new team, brand new to Xfinity. It's been in trucks. Um, how, how did this deal come together? I, I know you've made some truck starts for them in the, in the past couple of years, but uh, you know, did, did that kind of lead to this? Uh, how how'd that relationship get started? Yeah, that certainly started our relationship. I never knew, um, you know, this was in the cards or in the plan for AM Racing. Um, it really started with Kevin Swinsky and our team president, Wade Moore. Um, you know, they asked, they asked me and my manager to go to lunch, and they just kind of wanted to share their plans, and I didn't really know what to expect going into it. And uh, at one point, Kevin kind of flat out said, we want to race for an Xfinity championship, and we want to give you the best cars that we possibly can, and we're going to do a full effort here. So, um after that meeting, I was pretty much hooked, and then it became how do we how do we make this all happen and and get the right people in the right places, which fortunately fortunately enough we did, um, and it's so far you know coming off a top ten last week and then a qualifying lap's a qualifying lap, but it still um, means we have a lot of speed, which is good. For sure, for sure, and this car, if I believe it right, it has Stuart Haas Racing support, uh, so. How closely are you guys working with them? How much is this of the speed is them? How much of the speed is you guys? Yeah, I mean, it's a lot of, I would say, raw speed kind of comes from them, um, you know, because we're buying cars from them. We're getting some info from them. Um, you know, so it's a good working relationship. And then, obviously, the Roush Yates power under the hood. But um, reuniting with Joe Williams as a crew chief was, you know, a big confidence booster for me. Uh, we worked really well together at Our Motorsports at the beginning of that. And, um, you know, it's it's finding someone that knows your driving style, knows what you like, and, and how you can work together to achieve that. So uh, the handling side kind of comes back on us a little bit. Um, but obviously we have to have really good equipment, and we're supplied with that from Stuart Haas Racing. For sure. Now you mentioned Joe. Uh, was he – did you go out and get him? I know you worked with him before at, at Our Motorsports. Uh, was, was that your call, or was, was he already there, like, working with – who came first, I guess? Yeah, no, I, he was the first person I texted. Um, you know, it, it just makes a lot of sense. When you can have a choice to, to choose to who you work with, um, you know, going back to someone you've had a lot of success with and work really well together, um, that's the first choice right away. Uh, and then as well as his past experience last year – being part of the Stuart Haas program um, with the 07 car, um, you know, it just it tied everything in. There was a lot of undertaking that these guys had to do to get us ready to get here um, in a very short amount of time as far as getting cars ready, um, getting everything in place. But, you know, everything just kind of fell together perfectly to, to be able to come out of the gate strong. Um, you know, I feel like if we didn't have the right people where we have them now, it would take a while, you know, to get the ball rolling. And thankfully it's – just kind of a plug and play effort. Um, surround yourself with good people and good things happen. All right, well, thanks so much, Brett. Good luck tomorrow night. Thank you. This is Austin Dillon, driver of the Bass Pro Shop Chevrolet. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. Also, check out one of those two videos beside me. Visit frontstretch.com for more racing content.